Hello, this is Dan Alford with the Arc Specialties Weld of the Week, where we showcase an interesting weld and the backstory of its application in industry. We're going to talk about the technology of both the welding process and the Arc video monitoring system we use. This week we showcase a narrow gap TIG welding technique. We thought this was patentable. We submitted it to the patent office. It was rejected. So if you end up using this, at least send us a note and uh, give us some credit for it. You may be familiar with magnetic arc oscillation. Works extremely well except the probes can't fit in the narrow well grooves. So our idea was to use the series hot wire running at one hertz in a series circuit. The workpiece does not serve as a ground. Instead the electricity flows from the hot wire power supply down one wire into the weld puddle and then back up the other wire. Since we're running AC at one hertz the polarity swaps every second. That is what's causing the arc to oscillate. It's the electromagnetic force generated from the flow of current in the hot wire. The challenge with narrow groove butt welding is sidewall fusion. And by oscillating the arc, we wash the arc up into the sidewalls and we ensure good fusion in solid wells. Our friend Bob Rourke coined the term Tango TIG for our invention, and I kind of like that. The vision system that we used to capture these images was invented by Jean-Luc, the very first French astronaut. The problem in arc video is high dynamic range. That means we need to be able to look at something that's extremely bright and we also need to be able to see the features around it which are not nearly so brightly lit. Well apparently astronauts have exactly the same problem when they're trying to fly the space shuttle. You've got the sun in your eyes and yet you're trying to dock with a ship. So Jean-Luc invented a clever system to create a high dynamic range camera and using analogous thinking, you know one of my favorite subjects, he applied it to industry and the best application is welding. So these are images are taken from Jean-Luc's cameras. We look forward to posting new episodes of the Arc Specialties Weld of the Week. If you're one of the thousands of operators of Arc Specialties equipment around the world and you have a weld that you would like to showcase, please contact us. At Arc Specialties, we thrive on problems. Send us yours.